longer to heal if you pick in the scab got a hey guys what's up today i'm going to show how to make the infinite clone effect in after effect so without wasting any time let's jump into it so guys we're back in after effect now i'm going to show how to make that effect now i already have my clip this is from baby tron music video then i'm gonna cut this somewhere around here when it's at when input the hands so up right here i guess Cut that now. I'll right click it and hit pre-compose, move all the attributes and make sure to check this. Then select your rotoscope icon and just rotoscope out to your subset. Once you have your rotoscope froze out, duplicate the layer by hitting Ctrl B one time and delete the rotoscope from the bottom layer. And you can also rename this. I'm gonna call this BG and I'm gonna call this subject. Selecting my subject layer, I'll hit Ctrl D one time. And in the bottom layer, I'll just cut one frame, only one frame like that. Then I'll hit P to bring up my position. And you can just offset the position. Then you can also hit R to bring up your rotation. And you can offset the rotation too. And I'll go to the position again, play with go. It's just about playing with the position and playing with the rotation to get the other look you wanted now i duplicated this layer again i'll cut the warm frame like that i'll do the same in here hit position and offset the position first hit r playing with that position again align it so as you can see we already had that kind of animation you can repeat this a lot of times so i'll do that and I'll see ya guys As you can see, we already easily have the crazy infinite clone effect, and you can add uh, some things into it, like your favorite presets or color balance adjustments, tint to change the color. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna let you do that and then use your creativity on this effect. So that's it for today's video, guys. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe for more videos like this. And see you later. Bye.